Oh, I don't think it is. I think it's just saying we can build it. I read it wrong. We can adopt a new tradition. Let's see what we're looking at here. Do we want to? We can adopt this one. Gives us a little more squad defense. We do not enter disorganized states. And reduce penalties from retreating. 20%. Food in all provinces. One gold per good. Currently is none. We don't have any goods yet. But we will get some. Two to our maximum inventory slot. And 25 squad defense when sieging. Three gold in religious settlements. Anything that gives us gold and food would probably be good. Infantry and defense squad manpower. And their attack and melee defense. All of these would actually be pretty decent. Minus 10. Kingdom happiness. We're already at minus 10, so that's going to be bad. 50 count, crown authority discount would be good. We actually need to hit that button, don't we? Vassal income, lose some corruption. I don't think that one. I think if we do anything, although this is going to be all of our cash. One gold per good or three in religious settlements. We have a lot of religious settlements, and this gives us people as well. I think I'm going to hit this button. opinion has improved. That should give us four there, five, six there, and none up here. That should have given us six gold. Opinion is increased because we took medicine. That's good because they currently don't like us. Our queen has given birth to and another princess. princess. So it's not going to be, it looks like we did get a little bit. Not quite six, I think. Maybe it's still coming in. There we go. Hit that, drops it to just minus five. Where did all of Jerusalem's people go? Or maybe we just got a plus five, that's right. Yeah, we just got a uh, bonus to a bunch of our people. All right, they're at plus five. I don't think they're going to rebel soon. I don't think they're going to rebel soon, and I don't think they're going to rebel soon, but Antioch almost certainly will. So, since we can't get cavalry... Ah, come on. Let's just move you into Antioch. Go. There we go. Prince Andrew has grown up. We can get medicine, which will give us the reduced penalty from retreating at rank 3. Because we have the tradition for medicine, we could get plus army, army morale or the infantry and spear defense and the squad resilience. I think we'll go this one for the morale. And it does give us the inspire riot. Ability also. Our population is rebelling. Uh, really? In Tripoli. So I guess this... Well, it dropped to minus 12 now, although 16 of that's rebellion, so I think it was still high. I guess this button means nothing. I don't think that means anything about rebellions. Any tactical advice? Let's turn you around and attack right now. These guys are fairly decent. Light spears and some peasants. We've got a much better general, so we should be all right. Don't, uh... Prevail there we go. Die. Yeah, let's build a market in Antioch so that we can get these ones. They're very expensive, but especially this one and this one. I mean, either one gives us three gold and three commerce for a little more trading. Either one of them. Decisively, is it say I'm any dead? 250, not bad. That'll save us some money. Good job. Destroy these rebels. Sire, we've been victorious. Our army's opinion has improved. Perfect. Sire, Sire, 
A rebel army has been defeated. First thing there is near Jerusalem. There's a new pope. The rebellion is over. We got 600 golds. And... Army is a little happier. Nobility is a little happier. Still not... This is a good strategy. Let's see. Can we get a, another sword? We can. Let's do it. So that our military is at full strength. And you go off. All right. So, Damascus, we don't have anything. They're a little bit sympathetic. Let's see if a trade agreement. That is a no. Oh, we've got a trade agreement. Of course, we are trading with them already, so don't need that. We've got a trade agreement with these guys as well. Is there anyone else in the area that may be... Open, I guess we could try the Byzantines. So, trade could be beneficial if we give them 700 right now. Sure. I'll do that. That'll get the merchants to like us a little bit more. And the Seljuks have crushed Yemen. The Yemen resistance. Rome wants us to join war against the Alaniacs. Uh, these guys are both saying no thank you. Sire, the peasantry is delighted with our actions. And I think I agree. Peasantry opinion has increased because... Uh, I don't know why, but it did go up. For Christ and glory, a new crusade is coming. We got a lot of population this time. Even Jerusalem has quite a few, so we should at least have our soldiers. It's going to depend on how... I don't know what happened there. It's going to depend on how uh, loyal Antioch can be. Low stability in Antioch, yeah. Piety, it's the wrong religion. Ten percent because it's ungoverned. So we really need a governor out here. Can we get a? Uh, yeah, we can get you as a marshal. We don't really need another marshal, but um, yes, put you in Tripoli, be and we'll have you govern Antioch. That uh, makes perfect time sense. To train some men. I haven't slept in a bed for ages. That should give us a little bit more gold, right? The crusade has fulfilled its holy goal. Mecklenburg is gone. Oh, there it is. It's still getting established. So what would it be to get you to convert these guys? Preach 700 gold, 1,000 piety. The gold isn't too bad. Piety is a little far off. Let's look at Jerusalem. We built a church here. 950 orphanage gives us two piety in town and then four because we have all the monasteries. I think we should do that for sure. And this one's pretty good as well. We don't have charcoal, wine, or herbs, so we could get charcoal, though, it looks like. Like we have the uh, opportunity to get charcoal, so maybe you don't have to have it in the province. In the original, I may have said already, but in the original, you have to have all of it in one province to get those uh, boosts to some of this stuff. Like uh, it says there, it requires candles, and candles have to have... Candle maker in herb gardening. So this has to have herbs. Whatever it is, uh, it all has to be in one province. And maybe that's not true in this one, which would make it a lot easier to get a lot of these goods. Antioch, everybody that uh, is born goes straight into the rebel side. How are you guys doing, though? Only one in Tripoli. Akur and Jerusalem now very, uh, very pacified. So we're doing better. 70 gold, I think it's fine to hit that button. I assume Jerusalem, because that's where I've been building it, but it's actually Tripoli this time, yeah. 
Let's go and do... I think we're still waiting for this one. I think we still want uh, the Royal Armory. I did in one game get it built. And then uh, didn't actually lose to Rebels in that one. I was still doing very well, but I hadn't gotten one trained yet. Paul goes able to bring back books. Uh, I'm going to say no thank you. Foreign Merchant from Aleppo. That's fantastic. Tomorrow Speaking of books, can we get easy. our... Uh, somebody trained here. Let's train our... Well, I guess it doesn't matter too much. Let's train our merchant, see if he can make us some more money. Doesn't look like he's got anything that will. God bless you, my lord. Chance to convert occupied towns after a siege. And we are going to want to convert it. And a plus five happiness in the town that he governs. That one might actually be pretty good as well. I think we're going to go with this one and see if it helps him convert Antioch. Are you in need of my counsel, sire? Can he actually get another one? Thank you. Yeah, there we go. We'll get both of them. Why choose? Pourquoi pas les deux? All right, we're going back up to two. A lot of the rebellions have calmed down. Antioch is still. I feel like what we should do is train this guy before he switches over to rebel, right? Use him, and then he can't rebel. A diplomat has dissolved the defensive pact <clears throat> there we go. The defensive pact against us has ended. The Byzantines no longer feel threatened. Oh. Home, sweet home. You guys can stay in Antioch. All right. There we go. Trade center was moved. Let's take a peek out here and see if there's anybody that is... Uh, the Danishmen's here are starting to grow. They could be a target at some point. The uh, Seljuks don't like Aleppo. If we attacked them, then they would be happy with us. A lot of people the Fatimids don't like. And the Byzantines, of course... And they're actually fairly well liked. Not a lot of good targets. Of course, we're surrounded by people we have alliances with. Um, perhaps he can lead us. He's talking to us from jail. Everyone is saying we ought to do it. All of our guys. I just don't want our uh, thing to go down and we get hit by rebels. I think we'll be fine. I'm not really afraid of the Danishmen. Uh, they are not liked by a lot of people in our neighborhood. I think it'll be good for us. They are a vassal of rum, so rum will be mad. Let's hit it. Okay, rebels in Antioch knew that was going to happen. Byzantine likes us. Rum doesn't. Aleppo likes us. Perfect. Let's go back here. Grab you guys and fight this rebel real quick. A rebel army is besieging one of our towns. Reinforce our there we go. And then we'll take these guys and come right up into uh, Tarsus here. Pretty sure that's owned by the Danish Mind. And we can try to grab that one back right away. I think that we now have the ability to commit to charity. A little bit of upkeep, but... Gives us some bonuses. When we finish this one right now, I think we have to finish this uh, province siege. Then maybe we can convert it. Spread religion. This one will cost us piety, and uh, as much as it would be good to spread it to other people, we got to get it in our own realm first. So, it's leading the army against rebel scum in Antioch.
It's minus six, but we only have four here. I don't know where the other two are coming from. That rebellion, that war. Looks like it's fairly even at the moment, but I think they're... Well, no. They were at war with Sicilia here, I guess. But they're winning it. Rebels in our land were defeated, my lord. We've successfully defended one of our towns. Got 300 gold. Nobility is happy. How are you guys doing? You're uh, not terrible. Let's get in here. What would it take to replenish? Yeah, let's just top you off and then head for Tarsus. You can confide in me. All right, siege is over. We still have to wait for 200 books, which are coming slowly, perhaps, but they're coming. Where's the duck with his quotes when you need him? I'm just going to go straight in. They shouldn't have much here. It's still in disorder. It looks like we can take this city pretty quick. And, uh, I mean, Antioch is still maybe not completely under control, but the rest of our realm is fine at the moment. So we should be all right here if we take another settlement. We can construct buildings. We're waiting for 4,800. Just go, yeah. No reason to wait here. At 4,800, we can get our better armory in Tripoli and get started training these elite troops. That's what we're after. I assume we haven't lost any. That's why there wasn't a uh, thing there. Yeah, it came out of that with full strength. Very nice. Can't upgrade while we're in disorder. This guy we wanted to convert. 65% chance. Pretty decent odds there. So I guess we'll just do established order here. It will make a lot of people dislike us. Aleppo demands we attack Damascus. That's a no thank you. Still going to say no. They were saying we should do it, but uh, I don't think think that that's uh, what we want here. Although they are currently at war with a lot of people, including the Fatimids, and possibly losing. So maybe they were right. We should have taken it. Could have grabbed Damascus. Probably could have got it pretty easy. I hate to be fighting in two directions at once, though. Although we do have a second army out here in Tripoli. Well, we have a second commander out here in Tripoli at the very least. So we could really raise a second army. We've got the cash for it. We're only making seven. Uh, I think there's a lot of expense going into our converting. Religion and culture is 65 expense. Yeah. Almost all of it is because he's trying to convert. Yeah, it would be great to get Damascus, wouldn't it? They've got a uh, a mine. It doesn't say, does it? Uh, it does. Iron, uh, lodestone, herbs and spices. That's probably what you need for your candle maker. Appease the clergy. You know what? If you can do it, buddy. We don't have enough. Uh, we don't have enough piety, and we're not going to get enough for a while. So. Perfect. Tarsus is now orderly. Antioch got a guy. Is he going to go rebel or is he going to stay as a nice compliant worker? So this one has to have metalworking before it can be done, but sulfur trade can go right away, and it's uh, just about 900 gold away. When he stops converting, we'll make a little bit quicker. What do you have out here, Tarsus? Some more rare game. I think we've already got one of those up in here. We were wanting to actually build it, but uh, maybe we'll do that when we get to 19. We'll get that one first. It will give us a little bit more trade capacity, and... 
We don't have a lot of it to spare at the moment. We've already got timber and barrels produced. I don't know if we can afford to just keep running straight forwards. Uh, if we actually got another army, though, we could have someone watch for rebels and have that guy go straight north. Let's see. <coughs> oh, man, excuse me. Should we just take regular archers? If all you're doing is fighting off rebels, we'll just go a couple of units of archers here. And then... We'll take a few... Spe Ooh, we're uh, negative in our food here. A sword. Minus two food. We need to fix that. But let's move you forwards. Are you going? Okay, there you go. Move you forwards, and then we can move you forwards as well. So I think this one will rebel. We just need a little bit out here to keep it in line. And then you can get crop rotation. It'll give us another two food, which will put us even. And we can't train anymore, but at least we won't be uh, starving. Respect. My authority. Let us starve them to death. Our cleric was successful in... Hey, there we go. The Clergy's a little bit happier, and we got Antioch converted to the one true religion. That should lower their... Perfect. So these guys maybe aren't going to rebel. They're in positive stability. Should we march back to the castle? Clergy with an enlightened mission. I think we're going to say no thank you. We are sieging here. We've got better troops. The morale does favor us a little bit. We just have to... Actually, we can probably go pretty soon. This has to be at... Uh, what's half of 2.30? 1.15? And it's at 1.47? It's getting close. I think we're in a better spot than we were last time. We're certainly uh, taking some territories over here. Is he still... I think he went straight in to convert Tarsus next. Because our income is still low. Yeah, there it is, Tarsus. Currently converting Tarsus. Once he's done, he will continue in another province if needed. Okay, so you pay the upfront cost... And then you just pay the, uh, so maybe it's good to capture a bunch of land and have them convert it all at once. Sire, we have completed an upgrade. There we go. Our food's back to even. Like that. We were considering an orphanage, weren't we? Maybe at 950. It'll take us a minute to get there. But at 950, maybe we do this. That'll increase our piety a lot. Trade center from Constantinople to Thessalonica. That's uh, got to hurt. Why are these guys coming to relieve? No, that's a different uh, different nation. The world at your fingertips. So we got this one. We're currently in this province. And then there's one more. We could just kind of cut... Uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. We could cut Anatolia in half. Which maybe there's a benefit for it. Our army 
Our stability is a lot better than last time. Not 100% sure how I did it. I did build housing in Tripoli. And we built housing, which gives us a little happiness, I think. Failed in Tarsus. He's going to try again. That's kind of annoying, because I guess we could cancel him uh, manually. We'd like to have a little bit more income coming in, but it's probably fine. Do we attack now? Their morale's very low. It's at 16. Ours is starting to go down a little bit. We do have better troops. I think that we go. I think maintaining the siege is hurting us more than it's helping it. Slightly in our favor. Let's see what we can do. We get housing in Tarsus. That would make them a little less likely to rebel. We do have, uh, what are we? Got two villages? Yeah, we got two villages and a crop thing. So we could even do, uh, some crop rotation for food. Winning decisively, very nice. Uh, don't think we're gonna do this. He'll give us books, but I don't think we're really short books. That's Although we could do, um, we have received a diplomatic message. more promotions if we had more books. Medicine. Still didn't get medicine. We could do infantry tactics, a little bit of squad defense. This one is better. Yeah, this one is better against rebels. And he's our rebel buster, so I think picking that one's a good choice. And then we still have one more we can do. Squad defense. Let's do medicine. Plus two in town. Can always use more manpower. What do you want to build? And... Damascus wants us to attack the Fatimids. I'm going to say that's a fat no. They are quite stronger than we are. They're probably going to give us money. Nope. Fine. All right. And Kayseri is ours. Kayseri. Town Siege 1, the army is more happy. Can we establish order? It's going to make everybody hate us. Yeah, the uh, Byzantines will lose a lot, but our clerk, our clerk is currently busy. Our priest, I guess he is. I was thinking clergy. He's currently busy, so we're just going to have to establish order. And then the question is, do we keep going up and finish these guys off, or do we hold out now? War Exhaustion is going up. Kingdom destroyed. If we look at relations, everyone around us is starting to get kind of pissy. I would hate for them all to attack us. We do have a pretty strong military here. With uh, We've got two armies, at least, and they're, they're not the, the worst. I think we could take that one pretty quick, although they do have a, uh, an army right outside the walls of peasants. Disorder has ceased in one of our there we go. Disorder ended, so our guy's good at getting people under order. Preaching has failed. He's going to go to Kayseri and try there. I guess that's fine. Looks like our king died. Long live King Andrew. So we lost our... Well, we didn't lose him. We lost one of our marshals. In fact, it's this guy right here, it looks like. That nobility went down. Let's just, I guess, hire a new one outside here. My liege. Yes, my lord. What is your wish? We'll arrive soon. As you wish. Can you do anything? Are you stuck? We'll arrive soon. Army's moving. We'll arrive soon. Home sweet home. Yes, my So I hope those guys didn't go. I hope they didn't go, uh, mercenary. Roaming army for hire. That's gonna be super annoying, isn't it? Come on, guy. Out of the city. Let's do it. 